Hello and welcome to the Kenneth for Camel Law Office legal podcast looking at recent criminal cases. This edition we look at State versus Sylvester where the New Jersey Appellate Division held that a criminal driving while suspended conviction was going to be upheld even though the underlying DWI conviction was vacated. Now NJSA 2C colon 40-26B makes it a fourth degree offense to drive when one's license is, suspe- is suspended or revoked for a second or subsequent conviction for the violation of 39-4-50, which in New Jersey is DWI. I'd say, yeah, in this case, the defendant had the DWI. Um, his attorney made a motion and vacated the DWI. In a bench trial before the law division on the criminal driving while suspended charge, the defendant argued that her second DWI conviction uh, had been voided by the municipal court when it granted her PC, PCR post-conviction petition two months after she was indicted for the count of criminal driving while suspended. There, the defendant then argued the state cannot rely upon the vacated DWI conviction to meet its burden of proof. The trial court rejected this argument and the appellate court affirmed. It was undisputed the appellate division held that at the time the defendant committed the offense, she was aware her driver's license had been revoked by a valid conviction for DWI. The court relied upon um, State versus Gandhi to hold that the second DWI conviction vacated through the PCR, I'd say, yeah, I'd say, I'd say, was retroactive and could not be applied to bar the conviction under the statute. And that's State versus Sylvester, the docket number A. 5192-12T4. For other information on criminal and traffic matters, visit website njlaws.com. That's njlaws.com. And website benotguilty.com. That's benotguilty.com. For representation, contact the laws of Kenneth for Cameron and Edison at 732-572-0500. Thank you and good luck.